Good evening, I'm Dick Brennan. We begin tonight with new information on a story about high water bills we brought you yesterday. Eight years after DeKalb County addressed sky-high water bills, some residents say they're still having problems. As the county considers a water and sewer rate hike, advocates say the county must do more to help its struggling customers. Reporter Valencia Jones has our top story at 8.30. A water bill is threatening to devastate me and my family. Sameev Garrett says her DeKalb County water bill grew to more than $82,000 within nine months after she moved into a two-bedroom duplex in Stone Mountain. After following the directions of county officials for over a year in the hopes of rectifying my situation, I still had my water disconnected. She says after her landlord repaired leaks on the property, the county agreed to reduce the bill and reconnected her service. But she says she cannot afford to pay it. The county continues to bill me $500 per month. The county insists I still owe $10,000. Tuesday, she met with advocates who say skyrocketing water bills and shutoffs are disproportionately impacting DeKalb County neighbors. Since 2023, according to county records, DeKalb County has shut off more than 4,500 residencies due to non-payment. Both shutoffs and water liens, as you can see from this map, are more prevalent in census tracts with higher percentages of black residents. Disabled folks, many of them who require consistent water access for medical needs, they are placed at severe risk when water is shut off, especially due to unaffordable bills. Advocates now fear a proposed water and sewer rate hike will make matters worse. DeKalb County CEO Michael Thurman has said the rate hike is vital to fund the $250 million needed to replace roughly 1,000 miles of aging water pipes. We demand that the commissioners vote no to a rate hike, and we insist that all residents in DeKalb County have equal access to affordable, clean water under the law. To DeKalb County officials, I say you have the responsibility to to end this suffering and the time is now. They're also demanding more water affordability programs and shutoff protections. The county says its water bills are currently just over one and a half percent of a median household's income, which is below the national average of just under two percent and lower than Atlanta's and other cities. It also says several options are available, including its DeKalb Cares program to help identify and fix leaks, one-time ERA utility assistance to renters impacted by COVID, and extended payment plans. DeKalb County says it's also considering a possible one-time assistance fund for those facing disconnection and emergency discounts for eligible fixed income customers. They're encouraging all residents with unresolved water billing concerns to file a dispute by contacting DeKalb County Water Billing at 404-378-4475 or DeKalb Water Billing FN at DeKalbCountyGA.gov. You can also request an installment payment agreement online at www.decapcountyga.gov forward slash installment. Valencia Jones, Atlanta Now News.